Welcome to the Liverpool Beatles Museum, the world's most authentic, unique and original Beatles Museum. And why do we make that claim? Because we have rare, one-off items that you cannot see anywhere else in the world. The Beatles went out to Hamburg in 1960 and they played for eight hours a night, seven nights a week. It was their baptism of fire and it forged them into an amazing band that went on to shake the world. But things didn't end up quite as they should have done on that first trip to Hamburg. Um, George had to go home because he was found out to be underage. Pete and Paul got deported. Um, uh, John uh, followed on later and Stu came back in the January of 62. But they knew they were coming home. They knew they were coming home. They just didn't realise they were coming home as quickly as it turned out. So Pete had written uh, to Neil Aspinall in Liverpool asking him to prepare posters that the Beatles were coming back to Liverpool. And don't forget, people didn't know who the Beatles were. So the whole thing was tease the people, tease them. Don't tell them who we are, just let them know that we're coming. The first poster to that effect, there was only two made, the first poster to that effect was the Beatles are coming, the Beatles are coming. And people are asking, who are the Beatles? And they're being told, wait and see. Then the second teaser poster, here soon the Beatles, here soon the Beatles. And again, people are, who are they? Who's coming soon? Where are the Beatles from? And then the final poster, the one that's like, hey, they're here, was the fabulous Beatles direct from Hamburg, Germany. And that caused a lot of confusion because everyone thought it was a German group coming to play the Casbah. And that also spread through Liverpool for a short time that the Beatles were a German group who spoke exceptional English in a Scouse accent. Um, but you can only see those initial posters for the Beatles' first show in Liverpool after Hamburg here at the Liverpool Beatles Museum on Matthew Street.